Today's topic in reproduction in bacteria is sexual reproduction in diversity of living world. Unit 1, Chapter 1 in Botany and Biobotany. So sexual reproduction. As you have studied the asexual reproduction, there is no involvement of gametes. Only the spore formation that takes place in the asexual reproduction. In sexual reproduction, normally the gametes are involved. The fusion of gametes results in zygote formation. Okay. But in bacteria, no such like um, such like process are taking place. That is gamete formation or fusion of gametes doesn't take place. So it is absent. So gene recombination can occur. So the gene recombination only is going to take place. And based on that, it is classified into three types. Conjugation, transformation, transduction. So conjugation. This was given by Lederberg and Tatum. So they demonstrated conjugation in E. coli in the year 1946. So Lederberg and Tatum had given conjugation or in E. coli 1946. Okay. So now I will explain with the help of the diagram. So the in the presence if a bacteria contain a plasmid, a plasmid is a extra chromosomal one. If a bacteria contains plasmid, then that that is called the fertility factor F plus cell. So it is the donor cell. And this bacteria doesn't have the plasmid. You can see there is no plasmid here. Okay. So it is called F minus. F minus cell. This cell is called F minus cell. Okay. Now the pili. That is the pili forms a conjugation tube. A conjugation means a way which connects the these two bacteria okay these two bacteria are connected by the pili so the pili can be called as sex pili so now the conjug that is now the connection starts and the way is formed you can see the way here and ap after the formation of the wave the plasmid replicates and allow the segment to enter into the bacteria f minus bacteria you can see the DNA material entering into the bacteria. So after entering into the bacteria, the that is the plasmid entering into the F minus bacteria, it starts replicating and forms a circular structure called the plasmid in this. Now this F minus bacteria is called as F plus bacteria. And now the conjugation tube is destroyed. You can see it. So now both the bacterial cell are F plus. So this is called conjugation procedure. This is the conjugation method, method of asexual reproduction. So the gene transfer, the donor cell gets attached to the recipient cell with the help of pili. Okay. So with the help of pili, you can see here, this is the pili. Okay. The plasmid of the donor cell, which has the plus F plus undergoes replication. So here you can see the replication. No. So it undergoes replication. Okay. Only one strand of DNA is transferred to the recipient cell through conjugation tube. So only one strand that is two. Only one is transferring here. That is you can see here. Hmm? The recipient completes the structure of double stranded DNA by synthesizing the strand that complements the strand acquired from the donor. So from the donor DNA, from the donor bacterial cell, this plasmid starts replicating and forms the double standard one. After the double standard is formed, the sex pili is destroyed and the, and the bacterial cells are separated and both the bacteria are F plus and F plus cell. That is fertility factor is seen in both the bacteria. So next we move on to the transformation. The transfer of DNA from one bacterium to another is called transformation and this was given by 1928 Griff in in which bacteria as uh, the conjugation takes place in the E. coli that was studied by Lederberg and Tatum and this transformation was studied by Griff in Diplococcus pneumoniae which causes pneumonial fever. He took two strains smooth colonies which are virulent it will a killer it will kill kills the host and a virulent that is r type it is that is it won't kill the host okay so he took the two strains now i will 
I will uh, I will explain with the help of the experiment. So R type, R type is rough colonies and it is aviral means it won't kill the host. So these cells are injected to the mouse and you can see the mouse is leaves, it won't die. Okay, this is the first step. Next step, S type. So S type is smooth type, given injected to the mouse. What happened? The mouse dies and heat killed yes type that is heat killed so the virulent condition that is virulent means the killer type cells are killed with the help of heat now you injected to the mouse okay the mouse leaves so mouse won't lie won't die okay the mouse leaves the mouse won't die now the r strain and the heat killed strain are mixed so they are mixed and given to the rat what happened the rat dies. Why means the virulent that is the virulent type and avirulent type. So the avirulent has the DNA no and virulent when it the that is the protein coat when the coat when the envelope itself so it transforms that is the R strain is transformed to the S strain. So the DNA is transforming when it gets the killer type smooth bodies. So that is called transformation, changing. So one to another. So one capacity of DNA to another capacity, another character of DNA. That is called transformation. So this was studied by Griff. And this transformation you will be seeing, studying in next year also. So keep it in your mind. And how this is the donor cell. And this is the donor DNA enter into the host. Okay enter into the host the recipient so what happens they multiply so one will get the transformation that is dna and another won't get it so the the, um, the dna the integrated dna which has this capacity will causes death to the organism okay so this is the procedure for transformation uh, transformation okay method of reproduction now transduction Zinder and Lederberg in 1952 had given this transduction in Salmonella. Okay, Salmonella. So, phage mediated DNA transfer takes place. So, phage means the virus. Along with the virus, the DNA is transferred. Okay, so that is called transduction. Two types are there. Generalized transduction and specialized transduction. Generalized tra transduction means the ability of bacteriophage to carry the genetic material of any region of the bacterial that is the virus that is the virus which infects bacteria is called bacteriophage carry the genetic material of any region of the bacterial cell that is called generalized transduction. Next specialized or restricted transduction. The ability of bacteriophage to carry only a specific region of the bacterial DNA. Also, it carries only the specific region. So, it can carry any, the first one, it carry any region of bacterial cell. But that is called generalized. Generalized means generally. Generally. So, the Tamil and English subjects are come to you or for all the groups. For all the four groups, the Tamil and English are general subjects. Okay. And... Specialized means you are taking different subjects like bi biology, uh, botany and zoology, physics, chemistry, like that, variating, no. That is called specialized or restricted transduction. So, the specific region only the bacterial cell can be mediated with the phage. So, that I will explain with the diagram. So, you can see the bacteria phage. This is the phage material and this is the bacteria. It is, ad ad that is, it is ad attached to it. So now the phage cells are inserted in it. This is one type that is this is generalized. So the phage material enter into that is DNA enter into it. Along the DNA it replicates. It replicates and it comes out. Okay. It replicates and it destroys the bacterial cell. The overall the cell is destroyed. So after destroying the phage material in the bacterial cell. That is one part. There is only one part. Will, will be attached to it that is 
the generalized means it can attach to any part of the bacterial cell so the phage containing so till this you seen you have studied it till that in the lytic cycle this position after this position this position is the generalized transduction where the phage material is mixed with the bacterial dna and that bacterial dna was carried out that is bacterial and the phage dna was carried to carried in all parts of the bacterial dna so that is called generalized but here what happened the phage dna only a specific portion only a specific portion that is specialized specific a little bit of dna of phage and the bacterial cell was interacted that is they joined and they traveled to this that is called specialized transduction so there are three types of sexual reproduction takes place in bacteria conjugation transduction transformation conjugation was given by lederberg and tatum transformation was given by that is um who's that man griff and this was that is transduction was given by zinder and zinder and lederberg so the organism used for conjugation is e coli and transformation is in that is diplococcus pneumoniae and for transduction they use salmonella thank you for watching the video if you have any doubts post your doubts in the comment box give a thumbs up share and subscribe to science easy tech channel